Did you all see yesterday's vlog with Darcy? Go check it out, upper right hand corner. It is live, it's great. She's a, uh, She was on America's Got Talent recently and amazing. All right, we're out here on our patio, minding our own business, eating lunch, doing work, getting things done, and apparently there's a garage sale in the area. <laughs> there goes another car, I guarantee they're looking for, so basically, our garage sale is tomorrow. It's Thanks, not today. So, but everyone keeps showing up right now because there's a garage sale in the area and look at all our stuff. So everyone everyone thinks that we're having a sale today, but it's not today, everyone. It's tomorrow. They may reveal clues as to how that person will behave at other times. For instance, watching Mac handle the situation may tell us something about him. Really? Working outside today. I love it. Just received some, uh, you know, not like the best news from work, but I'm going to talk to you about something I heard at last night's talk that I filmed, a lecture that I filmed, and it's literally helping me get through this tougher moment. Um, and it's raining. I'll share that with you here in a minute, but uh, the grass was getting a little dry, so this rain is spot on. Just catching up on some YouTubers out here on the patio, drinking a little coffee in the afternoon, and listening to the thunder. As long as I'm protected, I like lightning and thunder. So, can you hear it? Can you hear it? You'd uh, think I'd never seen rain before, based on how I react to seeing rain as a 30-year-old, 31-year-old. I just love rain. Basically, it's because we don't get much of it here. I just love it. I love it. watching the uh, weather roll in on the radar. It's coming, more rain is coming. Yes, we are not done. It was rainy, it was sunny, back to rain. This is uh, summer in Colorado. I have seen it snow in Colorado in July, just so you know, just so you know it. It's kind of crazy out here. It's kind of crazy in the wild, wild west. All right, on to the topic of the day, which connects to the title of the vlog. So last night I filmed in the evening a talk, a lecture, and the speaker was amazing. He was amazing. He covered a lot of different topics, but at the very end of his talk, he discussed uh, how to change your brain. And it was a very catchy uh, phrase that he used. And basically, the premise is, if you want to be more happier and more joyful in your life, psychologists have studied this over the last you know 30 years here in the United States. So his name is Thomas Daly, the speaker that I heard last night, and he said if you do this one thing, one thing, every single day, before you fall asleep, you will be happier and more joyful. What is it? Reflect back on your day and remember and think about and be grateful for three things that day. Three things. And guess what? Here's where it gets crazy. They can be positive things or negative things. For example, the rain. It's kind of cold out. I'm sitting in the carport doing work and it's kind of chilly. But that's like something to be grateful for because we have moisture here in Colorado where it's dry a lot of the time. So I am today, one of the things that I'm grateful for is the rain. But this speaker that I heard last night said that you reflect back and remember three things in today that you are grateful for. You do it for 21 days straight you will be happier and more joyful in your life. And it actually, and this is where it's a little above my pay grade, I don't understand how it changes your brain. If there's any doctors out there, or I guess psychologists, or 
whatever, I don't even know. But if how does that actually change your brain? It probably has to do something with the chemistry of your brain and the the inner lo the lobes <laughs> talking to each other. Anyway, so I challenge you, and this is the question of the day. Do you do this? Do you already do this where you reflect back to your day and think about, wow, I am grateful that I had Raisin Bran in my cupboard. I am grateful that I caught a green light on my way to work and I was not late. I am grateful that uh, my child is over the flu. I am grateful that I ran out of milk for my Raisin Bran because when I went to the grocery store, I ran into a good friend. Okay, those are examples of little things that we can be grateful for every single day. And if we do that every single day for 21 days straight, we will be happier, more joyful, and we will literally start to change our brain. Okay, I'm gonna buy a book on this because the speaker was so good. I'm gonna buy a book on it and I will communicate more of this to you all. But I just wanted to give you a little teaser, a little teaser. I just wanted to give you guys a little teaser, a little teaser. All right. I suppose I'm uh, <laughs> romantic at heart. Hi, babe. They're beautiful. Right, aren't they good? The they just were a little, you know, we just had some extra roses. Oh, this Hun, is the first it, of the let season. It be, let it begin. I'm gonna get them in a vase right now. This is yeah. <laughs> we should be publishing uh, 8 a.m. Mountain Time. So if you are a yokel local in the Greater Denver area, come by today, Saturday, June 3rd. Yeah. Yep. Third Saturday, June 3rd for a garage sale. We are ready for you. So. And bring your A game because we like to haggle. We're, we like to negotiate. That's right, dickering down. I'll say, what do you pay? And then I'm gonna up it. Yep. And I'm gonna say up probably it. not. Up it again. <laughs> we're gonna end up with all of our stuff. <laughs> we were just talking about we're gonna go shopping at our own garage sale. Because <laughs> a lot of the stuff is Nana's. So yeah, thank you, Nana, thanks, for Nana. donating yeah, to our garage sale. Thank you very much. Oh, all right. Seek beauty. Work hard. And love each other. See you tomorrow. At the garage sale. <gasps>